The crews expect to arrive in Virginia late tomorrow after the storm moves on. Homeowners here are probably interested in how well houses in the path of Isabel hold up in this storm. That could be less of a concern, though, in the future if a new type of home construction takes off. NBC 2 Xavier Osher is live in Charlotte County's Gulf Cove, where a hurricane-proof home is being pioneered. Amy. Craig, it only took two weeks to get to this point. The first thing you notice when you drive down the street, this house is made entirely of metal. It's hard not to sound like you're selling them, but if what the builder says is true, this could be the next big thing. This, this is a Ferrari. Henry Martinez would stack this home against any other on the market. In some ways, it's a sister to the supercharged sports car. This is roughly about 15 recycle cars. It looks like an erector set. The house is made entirely of galvanized metal, a construction method Henry borrowed from his commercial work in Miami post-Hurricane Andrew. All the commercial high-rises that we do, uh, Trump International has the same thing. This is the first time he's trying it on a house. Anytime there's a hurricane that comes, residential houses can't withstand the wind. This is a great room. The home already has an owner who admits being a hard sell. For me, it was something that I couldn't relate to. But he melted under the metal design pressure. This is the way we build a house. From the metal trusses to bolted floor beams, this house is built to stay put. The rating on it is, is, is far more than 150 miles per hour because what we use is corrugated metal. Everything gets stitched and overlapped. A house of this caliber may be breaking new ground in home construction, but there is something about it that rings vaguely familiar. Metal mobile homes have been around for years, and few consider them safe haven. You know, th those are more... Um very inexpensive pieces of metal infilled with plywood. Once it's finished with stucco, the house will look like a standard home. An added bonus, metal doesn't mildew. I, I just love it because I, it's going to help me breathe better. Now, Craig, to finish this home from top to bottom should take about a month and a half. And if you're wondering about price, ha prices, houses in this general neighborhood go between three and five hundred thousand. We're told this house, when it's finished, the house alone should go for about four hundred thousand dollars. Back to you. A hurricane-proofed home, Amy. Thank you very much for up-to-the-minute weather and travel updates on hurricane.